Hi, this is Brian Sachs with another reverse mortgage marketing tip for you. Uh, today, I want to share with you a couple things. We're ta we talk a lot about an online presence and what that means, and we'll cover a lot more of that in future reverse mortgage marketing tips. But I wanted to explain to you a little bit about Facebook, a little bit about Google, and some secrets that no one seems to be explaining, uh, also including YouTube. We have a YouTube channel. You're watching it right now, perhaps, or you're watching it on our Reverse Mortgage Success website. And um, we have a, a channel there called Reverse Trainers. Again, Reverse Trainers. You might want to check that out and become a fan. You'll see right here below that we just started a Facebook page, ReverseMortgageSuccess.com. I really hope you go there and join in the conversation. You'll also notice that if you go to Google and type in Reverse Mortgage Baltimore, that I've claimed my Google Places, which is also very critical. I can't go into all of the detail right now, but here's what I wanted to tell you. People will tell you, you should buy ads on Google, you should buy ads on Facebook. Well, you need to understand what that means. See, what is someone on Google searching for? How do Facebook ads work? And I want to take a step back and explain this to you. When you do ads on Facebook, you're actually going to have your ad appear on the targeted pages of people you target. They're not looking for your information. Your information will appear. So they may not be buyers. If you want buyers, you want to advertise on Google using Google AdWords. These are people who are searching for information on reverse mortgages. So I want to make that clear distinction for you so you don't get ripped off. So again, any advertising medium you're thinking about, think about what the buyer's motivation is. Someone on Google typing in reverse mortgages, they're looking and they have a need and you want them right away to... Uh, provide services to. Someone on Facebook where your ad is just appearing on their Facebook page, that's a totally different scenario and you're going to have to warm that person up. You're going to have to build a dialogue. You're going to have to create some content that's of value to them. So just understand those subtle differences. Again, you want to claim your Google Place. So if you go to Google Places, you can actually claim your Google Place, as I did for Baltimore, as Sue did as well. But um, there's a lot more to it, and I can't cover all of that. We're going to be talking about some of that in the course that we're creating that should be available very, very shortly. It's actually not a course. It's an unbelievable resource that's going to give you templates and everything you need. But I want you to understand those subtleties in anything you're using for marketing. Think about what the buyer's motivation is and some people are ready right away. Some people are only uh, seeing it for the first time, exploring it, and need to be warmed up. So a couple things. Go to YouTube and create your own channel. And you can do that just by going to YouTube, look at our channel, Reverse Trainers. Go to Facebook. Join us right down here. And we are Reverse Mortgage Success on Facebook. Look at that page. Think about ways you can create one of these for your own. And, um, of course, you can always use Google and check out Google Places. So that's it for today. Sue will be back on Tuesday with another Sue's Clues. And we have lots of great information that we're going to continue to share. Take away from this video. Think about what your buyer's motivation is. It's not a one-time shot. You need to continually communicate, give value till they're ready to buy. But there are some people who are ready right now, who are desperate, who need a reverse mortgage, and you can speak to them a little bit differently and have your call to action be a little bit different. Love to hear your comments on this. Just put them right down here. Have a great day. This is Brian Sachs with your Reverse Mortgage Success Minute. Till next week, stay tuned.